Well, thanks for watching this episode of Answering the Call. I'm Pastor Chuck Reese, your show host and executive producer. This is a series all about evangelism and discipleship, and we're highlighting ministries all around the world that are serious about doing just that. Today, we're in Salisbury, North Carolina, visiting Hood Theological Seminary, and with me is Dr. Virgil Lattimore, the president for the institution. Greetings. Thank you so much for joining us. Oh, honored to be here. So, when we talk about theological education and seminary, certainly uh, you're an institution that's equipping the saints for the work of ministry, and you guys have some history, so tell our viewers a little bit how Hood Theological Seminary started. Well, Hood Theological Seminary started uh, around um, in North Carolina, Concord, North Carolina, as a as Zion Wesley Institute, and it was uh, started by a group of African American uh, lay persons who were interested in being trained uh, as clergy and they approached an institute there in Concord and were told that they weren't qualified to be trained and so they decided to start their own uh, group that had been a discussion group and they became Zion Wesley Institute and uh, from there uh, that institute folded after a few years but it was the citizens of Salisbury who offered them a thousand dollars to move the institute to Salisbury, and they, uh, what became Zion Wesley Institute, became Zion Wesley College, and uh, from that college, um, it later became Livingstone College, and uh, named after the famous uh, English uh, explorer, uh, physician. Um, uh, David Livingstone and so uh, Livingstone College became a chartered institute and then uh, the, uh, the, they formed a, a theological school, a school of religion uh, which became Hood and later became Hood Theological Seminary in 18, 1885. Yeah. That's amazing. So yeah. 130, 130 years yeah. ago. Yeah. But that, making uh, disciple and disciple makers. Right. Yeah. So. And we've been here uh, as an independent uh, freestanding seminary that's approved by the University Senate, United Methodist Church, and the Association of Theological Schools. We've, we've been uh, about 20 years, we've been an independent school, an independent right. seminary. Yeah. So as the president for the organization, share with our viewers a little bit about the vision that God has given you for uh, the, next, the next part of this journey. Well, our vision is to be a... Um, uh, a place that trains uh, leaders, um, that focuses on uh, diverse, uh, diverse persons from a variety of, of theological backgrounds, faiths. Uh, we like to think that we are a place that reflects the kingdom of God in, in all of its variety and all of its uh, diversity and richness, differences, and so persons can come in and get a well-grounded theological education in order to have an impact on the world, particularly in the communities from which they come, whatever issues those communities are dealing with. Yeah, yeah. and a lot of your students are already in ministry They're already well. in ministry, yeah. yeah. Many of them already have been in ministry, or many of them have been in other forms that are non-traditional ministries, whether it's community, right. uh, agency, social service. Some have come out of social work, some have come out of emergency work, so uh, they come here with a sense that they now have a calling yeah. to be in the pastoral ministry. Amen. Yeah. That's good. Mm -hmm. So and a lot of them, not only that, have families and jobs. And so you guys are being able to uh, provide some different programs and study. Uh, yeah, we have the program. We have two tracks. We have a traditional track of persons who come during the day, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and then Friday night. Uh, persons come and they're here also on Saturday. So again, and then some people may mix, may do, may mix the two, given right. where they are in their lives and their jobs and yeah. their uh, their families. Yeah, that's good. Mm -hmm. That's good. Well, stay tuned. We we'll get some more interviews with some of the faculty and staff and some students who are plugged in here at Hood Theological Seminary, uh, being equipped for God's calling on their life. Hi, I'm Pastor Chuck Reesh. I'm the executive producer at Horizon Media Studios. It's a 501c3 media ministry, and what we're doing is helping other ministries tell their story. Homeless shelters and children's homes, Bible colleges, seminaries, mission sending agencies. With your help, we can continue to help tell their story to inspire the world, to shine their light, and let God get the glory for the work that's being done in advancing the kingdom of Jesus Christ. 
Thanks again for praying for us.